Oh, you sound from British television. Have you got a moment to spare to talk to us about yes, your revolution? Certainly, certainly. Well, we are about to hold a press conference and say give information on the Saturday before the Tuesday that the intention of the government was to search us and detain us. We decided to go underground. While we were underground, more information came to us on the Monday morning that the plan was that Gary was going to flee the country, leaving orders to have our leadership killed. We therefore, around 3 o'clock, summoned a council, a meeting of our top cadres, and there and then the decision was taken that we should move rather than wait to be killed. How do you see of the, the acceptance and successfulness of the revolution is the fact that business places have reopened immediately, no problems on that. Tourists, as you see, have continued to come to our shores. The American residents, including medical students, have not left. And of course, if you observe the entirely peaceful character of the revolution, in a sense, no bloodletting. Um, what of him? We want him back here for trial for murder, conspiracy to murder, for mass fraud, for corruption. That sort of thing.